what's going on youtubers welcome back to my youtube channel this is your boy lb guys today in this video i'm going to show you how to create your own light and then you put it in your video we're gonna use adobe photoshop premiere pro and lot generator this lot generator is gonna help us to convert preset into lot stick around and let's jump on it and let's see how it is okay guys as you see here i'm in adobe premiere pro in my timeline i have three different clips but it is the same song okay but i try to choose the different footages different location okay different look okay so the things i'm going to do as i told you this is the third clip which i have on my timeline this is the first one this is the second one and this is the third one so i'm going to take the screenshot for each footage so for this one let me take let me take the screenshot for this clip okay and i have to come here on this export frame you can use ctrl plus shift plus e and then you have to click here and then here this is the name of the frame which i'm going to export this is the format it is gpg so you have to choose the location okay my location let me choose it here the frame will go in this picture okay and then you press select folder and then you press okay so let me come back here on the second clip so let me choose this frame and then i have to click here and then I have to export frame and then let me come back here for this last footage so let me choose this frame and then you click for export frame and then you press ok let me take this time to talk about audio audio is a platform for a content creator providing music and sound effect i use the music license music platform but i always keep coming to the audio guys and this website is where i found the perfect music that i used for this video it has high quality product of every types of sound effect and music which you can use for different kinds of videos like educational videos vlogs and movie and other many kinds of video if you're a content creator guys this is your time to use audio guys check the link in in the description below you will get 70 percent of the first year my promo code is save 70 thank you so much audio for sponsoring my video guys when you're done for taking the screenshot in adobe premiere pro it is time to jump on in adobe photoshop so now let me come here in adobe photoshop so now i'm going to import that three images which have been exported in adobe premiere pro so now let me come and then click here for open up and let me choose where my picture it is this is my pictures and then you have to select it all and then click here open guys you see here it's automatically opened in camera row so and i'm going to edit my camera here in adobe photoshop camera low so the things i have to do you have to select it all guys you see my three images i have been selected all and i'm going to start to make the color grading so for this exposure i can increase some exposure here and then reduce this highlight yeah something like this and i can increase some saturation that's a few little bit okay and these vibrant something like this okay here you can increase some clarity if you want or if you don't want you can just put it uh, as a default zero okay guys so for this temperature it depends how the you have been set your camera but let me try to put it here on minus five okay so and then let me come back here on this hcl gray scale so when you click here on this setting here i have some different colors so and i'm going to try to increase the saturation for each color which i have in my frame okay so for example guys if you want to increase green you see for this green okay you can increase or decrease green okay so let me increase green just a few little bit and the yellow you see guys have yellow in my footage you see when i try to remove yellow you see how the it looks and then let me try to increase just a few little bit and then let me increase the blue this it is aqua and blue yeah this one and my orange yes that's okay 
but let me come back here on this hole so for this hole yes my color it is also coming back so but i want to change this green so here you can change this green in any color you want so let me try to put just the smooth green the thick green okay even on this yellow too i can add even green guys you see when you uh when i'm trying to balance my color you see how some changes okay <clears throat> so and i have to add green the pure green even this yellow okay so for the blue let me try to increase some occur the can you see let me try to put it yeah this color this is looks nice even this i have to put the same as color like this okay for this luminance let me try to let use just green a few little bit and this blue you see when i try to to decrease you see it brings some some looks which is very thick but when you add some more extra more you see it has the bad look so and you have to add just a few little bit okay so and then let me come back here for this effect now this camera calibration and they have to add some small hole for this red primarily and this blue primarily yeah you see guys you have to add just a few little bit just you have to keep your green okay in your camera when you try to increase some more you see the green becomes yellow so and they have to add just a few little bit and increase the saturation of this okay so you have to check for those three images this is the first one and this is the second one and this is the second uh, the third one guys for the third one it has more uh, bright so you can come back here for this basic and you can decrease this white okay and then you can decrease these highlights too even you can decrease this exposure let me decrease this exposure and increase this highlight and white you see how it comes this looks nice okay so let me select it all again and i have to change this temperature you see guys how it looks when you try to increase some red here you see that looks it looks bad okay so i have to decrease some temperature and i have to put like to my like minus 10 yeah this is good when i come back here for the first clip you see there is some it looks good also and for the third one looks good also guys the things you have to know you have to know how to color grading using this camilla low by using those all settings okay you can use it all these settings depend what the kind of color what the kind of look you want okay so when you're done you have to come here on these three lines and then you, you click on it and then i'm going to save these settings so for these settings means these color grading which i have been put it to my frame so now you have to click here on save setting and then come back here on save so i can rename it like my light so let me save it here in these pictures and then click save okay and then you click done so guys i have already done to make color grading for my frame so now let me open up this dot generator guys as i told you we are going to use three software so first i'm going to generate this hard so for generating this hard it will brings for all these rat generator software it will bring to me some a few images which i'm going to use okay so i have to click for generate hard 
and then let me save it in the pictures and then click select okay you see guys it will it is also it's done press okay so now and i'm going to import that image that i have been exported in this rat generator so and i'm going to open it is this one which is called neutral 512 so you open up and then i have to go here on a filter go here on the camera filter low okay and i'm going to import that setting they have been saved okay so you have come back here on these three lines and then i'm going to create here and i'm going to click here on load settings first we have been save settings so for the second step we are going to load this setting okay because we're going to apply it on this image so now let me go here on these pictures this is the setting which have been saved and then you open up you see the different okay and then you click okay guys so when you click okay guys and i'm going to save this image in png format so go here on go here on a file go here on a file click save as copy let me call it like png image and then you click ok and then press ok guys so and and i'm going to open up also my lat generator again for the second time and then for this second time i have i have to go here on convert to cube so you have to click this convert to cube and i'm going to find my png image it is this one not like this this is the first one who have been exported for the first time and then i have to choose this that we have been exported for the second time and then you click on it and then you click open guys you see the conversion is done so when it's done and i have to come back here in adobe premiere pro so as i told you i have a three different clip so and i'm going to create adjustment layer because i just want to apply that light in all clips for example if you have many clips you can create an adjustment layer to apply one light so you have to come back here on this project settings click here on this new item go here on adjustment layer and then press ok so you have to drag this adjustment layer on the top of this clip you have to put it just in this way so and i'm going to add or oh, and i'm going to apply my lat click on this adjustment layer and come back here on this workspace you have to choose color okay so come back here on this basic correction and i'm going to apply the lat so go on for this input light and i'm going to choose my own light so let me go on the pictures as you see here it has dot cube for this dot cube means it's lot okay you have to click on it and then click here on open so guys as you see here the rat is already applied to my video clip when you see this is my video clip and this is the second one and this is the third one so that was my lot and then this is before and then this is after guys it means here you can create your own light you can create your own look depends what kind of the look you want to apply to your video guys this is how you can create this effect this is how you can create this lot if you have any question please drop it in the comment down below i just want to know what you think subscribe share and comment see you in next video peace